Hello, welcome back to the channel. Thank you so much for joining me today. Well, I'm going to be reviewing this, the Canon 5D Mark IV battery replacement grip from Newer. Now, the original Canon 5D Mark IV grip costs almost £400, whereas this is only £43. So, is it worth it or should you just buy the original? Let's jump into it. So this is what's inside the box. You have some packaging, um, a little silica pack, and some instructions. Now, that's not very interesting. What you actually want to see is the grip. So let me grab that. And here it is. Here's the grip. So first off the bat, you're going to have this cap here that protects all the connectors. Quite nice to see. And you can also see that this is not stock, by the way. I've put this on just to show that there is... An attachment bar here which you can attach to the lanyard or any type of strap and yeah this is what this is just is demonstrating here here's the mounting point it is a bit hollow feeling it's not quite as good as the one on the camera itself but yeah this is the actual pack it feels quite nice in hand this grip is slightly rubberized and does feel quite nice the buttons themselves quite firm I mean Nothing really to say about these ones. The joystick, as you can see, is pointing down slightly. It's not quite centered, so it does work perfectly fine, but it's not the highest of quality. I mean, this is probably the worst bit of the whole grip. It just feels cheap and a bit rattly, but to be honest, it is only 43 pounds, and you know, that's a lot, of, a lot better than Canon's offer. So the other thing is the actual shutter release button. It is a quite clicky button. It's not as sort of um, smooth as the 5D Mark IV stock button. Here's your on and off switch. And this bit here is for actually, when you take off your battery cover, you can put it here so you don't lose it. And if you want to get the batteries out of this, you have this little end point here, which you uh, just pull down, twist, and then pull out. Feels quite nice actually. And then you can put your batteries in here. There's the connectors for it. Quite simple. Let's put that back. So let's uh, mount it to the 5D Mark IV. Okay, before we actually put the grip onto the Canon 5D Mark IV, we're gonna have to do a few things. First off, turn it upside down and release the battery cover like so. You'll be able to then see this little latch here in black. You're gonna have to pull that to one side to release this cover. It's quite simple, so don't be afraid. Just release like so and you can put that to one side while you take out the battery and that's it, you're now ready to go. So I mentioned earlier, there's this slot on the battery grip for your battery cover so you don't lose it. So first take off the white cover so you don't get in the way of yourself and then you have to align these pins in here. It's quite simple, just press it in, then fold it down and then you have to just pull this back and that's it, it's clicked in. All good so you don't lose it, very simple. Now I'm going to take out the battery slot and insert a battery so that we have one ready to go. So you can see here, there's a contact. So that's going to be going at the back. So the battery's going to go in like this. So we have to go from the front like that and then press down. And that's it. That's the battery secured, all good to go. So let's put that back in the grip. It'll work perfectly fine with just one battery or you can have the recommended two, just to balance out the weight and to get a better battery life. Okay, so now let's get the two attached. So simply just align the battery grip with the battery entrance and then gently push in and you'll feel it connect. And now we have to lock it. So just keep twizzling this and you'll see the battery grip get closer to the bottom of the camera as it goes fully into it. Just keep going. It'll feel a bit of resistance when it's done. And then you can see the red light going on to show that Yes, the battery is now powering the camera. So let's turn on the camera. You can see it is now on and it will tell me that there's no, there's no lens attached, but that's fine. So now we have the battery grip on. I should be able to just press this and it will start shooting. Perfect. So yeah, that is a simple tutorial on how to use the newer battery grip. Now I have to say it is nice to have this grip because it just adds some extra support when shooting landscape and obviously it's very beneficial for shooting portrait. So would I recommend this? Absolutely. For the price, it is fantastic. 
Now it's not as good feeling as the camera, I'm sure what the Canon equivalent would offer, but for the price it is very good and it gets you that extra stability and the ability to shoot portraits more freely for such a low price. So thank you so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed this short video. If you have, make sure to leave a like and a comment saying so. That's this video. Goodbye.